Do you ever feel like summons have become too powerful this weekly? Well, I want you to know that not all hope is lost. Summon teams this weekly heavily rely on support units such as Turkey, Spinosaurus, and Secretary Bird. Grab a Leopard, grab a Lionfish, scale them up, and you can target snipe their support units, dismantling their entire infrastructure. Can we just all take a vote um, and get rid of the, the Magpie? It's such a useless pet. I'm sorry. It, it is. I will stand by that. I don't think there's any purpose of the Magpie. At level 3, it is an avocado. That's it. <laughs> and what's the benefit of pulling over one extra gold? I, it's like, okay. I get the benefit. I do. I don't think it's even remotely worth it. Let's get rid of you. Do a little something like this. You know, it's just like, what's the point? Okay. And we draw. We'll take a draw. Alright. Level you. Um... Level you? What if we do like a leech eel into like a hippocampus kind of thing? That seems like it might be okay. Tell you what. Throw in the eel for now. I think I like the leech here. It's not like the best thing ever, but it, it's okay. Oh, we do it. Okay, we draw. If the Tsuchinoko didn't off itself in the beginning, that would actually been pretty good. Uh, we can bunny up here. Do we care about any of these? I don't think so. Roll me. Straight up, Tsuchinoko needs to go. We can run a spider, maybe? Do we ever peach the eel? Surely that's not worth it. I can't imagine it would be. Rude. And we're good. Love it. So the leech can actually take out the spider, interestingly enough. Maybe we'll get something good out of that. Probably not, but maybe. Okay, throw garlic on you. I like it. I love it. I don't think we care about you. I don't think we need a spider here. What do we get? A wyvern. Maybe. Definitely like a, a solid maybe there. Dude, garlic. <laughs> garlic is cooking right here. It's so satisfying when you get an early garlic. And you're just like, yeah, we're doing it. Um, hold on to you. Ooh. Dude, I can't say no to Foo Dog. I just can't. It's not in my nature. Speaking of giant garlic homies. <laughs> Found one. Ooh, do we have any- we don't have any faint pets? That is egregious. We rocking a tar, maybe? Get rid of you. Roll me once. Twice. <laughs> Deer works. I was like, dude, we can't settle on that. Come on. That would be ridiculous. Roll me. Hmm. I think we, we start leeching off of you now. Run it like this. I'd like to get a level 3 here on our bunyip soon. And we're good. Love it. Everyone gets garlic. Instant win if you do. Okay, here's the pivot. 
This is going to seem a little harsh, but I think this is how we got to do it. So we throw in a turkey. We get rid of our bunyip, who I know is one of our stronger units. However, we have to. It's a must do. Um, do we health potion on our eel? Do we even care about our eel? I honestly don't think we do. Like, what is he even doing right now? Nothing? That's what I thought. I think we're rolling. I like the deer. Ooh, are we actually gonna get hippocampuses? That would be huge. It's honestly so much untapped potential. The hippocampus. All we need is to get even just a level two would be huge. Nurikabe is probably the way to do it. Um, let's start out here. A little five, seven, combine, throw you in. Combine here. Hold on to you. Mimic will be for another day. Not this one. Nurikabe? Sure, let's run it. What do we got? Not bad, not bad. I am realizing that we're out of garlic again. And that's an issue. We sold off all of our garlic homies except for this leech. I think we're rolling here. And we could food dog, but what's the point? Get rid of you. And then, what do we got here? We really need a hippocampus. Like, super bad. <laughs> super bad. Roll me. And a turkey would be kind of cool, too. Uh, I think we start... Start with the deer. I think that makes sense. Hold on to the chocolate, hold on to a stegosaurus. We'll swap out the cockatoo next turn. Oh yeah, dude, this bus is doing work out here. That is huge. Okay. Now we gotta do this in a smart way here. We level you. Start me with a cow. Do we have a mammoth here? We could do like mammoth mushroom, but I feel like that's not, not gonna cut it, you know? I'm loving it. Um, I think we buy, sell you. I really can't help but feel that the leech is uh, not pulling its weight necessarily. Maybe that's just me, but I feel like 2-2 two, two every turn is not the best. Okay, perfect lethal. Honestly, love it. Can't ask for anything better there. Mushroom on you is probably pretty good. Let's try it. We go here. Wolverine doesn't work on chili. Already tried that one. I think we do here. Are we ever getting rid of the turkey? He's not doing anything. Hold on to you. Um, garlic is probably good. I don't know why the Stegosaurus is up front. Kind of just like he is, and that's just a good enough kind of vibe. Okay. A lot of chilies going around. Um, let's see. Sell you. A little buy sell. I'd like to get Stegosaurus level two, if possible. Maybe we don't need garlic. 
Oh, that's perfect. Um, we could buy, sell you. Maybe. Excuse me. Okay. Um, I... Honestly? Let's just stagger him. Stagger the Stegosaurus for now. That way we can split up the stats a little bit. I think that's actually pretty valuable. Okay, they did not split up the stats. <laughs> Whatever. Holy Christmas. Dude, this is just making me want to run a Mimic. To admit that got so much money. What the heck? Okay, combine you. What do we get? Could run a mammoth. So we could try to land the Stegosaurus on a leopard, but he's gonna have to get a lot of attack to make that work. Perhaps more attack than we can afford. Is it better than the leech though? Dude, the leech is so bad. What is he even doing here still? It's just actually horrible. Roll me. I mean... Throw you in, I guess. Give you a Yagdrasil. Hold on to you here. Hopefully it hits the leopard and then the leopard goes. It did not hit the leopard. And the leopard did not goes. Our bus got kind of sauce there, but <laughs> fortunately we're okay. Okay. Um, I think we should go hippocampus level three here. <laughs> I think that would be pretty good. Grab a banana for our mammoth, maybe. Get a little peach action going here. So we're gonna peach onto our Stegosaurus. Okay, that was pretty good. They're gonna need to keep his attack scaling up um, in line with the leopard as we keep scaling our leopard. And we're... How the heck do we get a perfect draw after all that? Isn't that crazy? Okay, we go here. Um, we want to make sure your attack is high enough that you go before the leopard triggers. I mean, straight up. You're giving... What is this? 2 times 16, 32, 32. I don't even think we need to get you to level 3. Go chicken leg. We desperately need um, levels on our leopard. I think that's like our, our critical path forward. Maybe we go cow? I'm not sure yet. Because the snipes are strong, but they are not plentiful. And that's going to be an issue here. Okay, we make it. Kind of like a scaling snipe vibe here. We got going. Okay, we go here. We go here. And straight up, I want to make sure the Stegosaurus hits the Leopard, so I'm not going to buy anything here. I think I'd rather hunt a little bit, look for another Leopard. Or a chocolate would also be nice. We did not find either, sadly. Solid snipe. I think we might be okay here. We got the leopard as our finisher in the back. Yeah, dude, we're totally cooking. <laughs> this is golden. So th the idea is there, right? So we get our Stegosaurus, scaling up our leopard so that we don't actually have to scale our leopard ourselves. 
this guy is an absolute essential. I think if you could get the leopard to level three, you could take out most of the summon guys this weekly. Honestly, I'm kind of feeling like Bunyip isn't as strong as I think he is, at least in this weekly. <laughs> Dry others. Keep it generic. This is getting dangerous. Because you just get like this, right? You know, you get tennis balls and then you're just kind of screwed. And yes, I'm aware that I could also run tennis ball, but <laughs> I don't think that takes away from the fact that they're a little, a little iffy sometimes. Hmm, I forgot that the Tsuchinoko was jumping. We should have won that one. Um, oh well. It happens. Ooh, Pegasus. Don't mind if I do. Right up. Let's do this. Just so we know for almost certain that we're gonna not lose this round. Yeah, I'm glad I did that. <laughs> this was a, a formidable opponent, we'll say. Alright, Funyip's gonna have to go soon. I think we can get rid of him here. And then we roll. I don't think we're, like, investing in the Mandrill here. Because it doesn't work with Fairy. Not in any meaningful way, that is. Which leaves us with... <laughs> Just the ten- not the tennis ball, just the balloon. If we want to ferret with the balloon, but that just seems like a colossal waste of everybody's time. I'm gonna opt not to do that, and then maybe we'll just say that we did. I honestly think we do this, and then throw in like a spider. Just cuz, you know? I don't like any of it really. Is it just me or does the, does this weekly kind of feel weak? The early game, I should say. Early game weekly, it doesn't feel like it does a whole lot. I mean, if you go like Pegasus vibe, sure, it's not bad. But is that really all we got? Uh, are we garlicking you? <laughs> Feels kind of weird to do that, but I think that's probably the play. Are we even going like spider here? I don't know. I don't love it. Ooh, that was a huge hit. Oh baby, we're doing it. I like how they're like flying in, and if your mouse is sitting there, they're like, hard stop. <laughs> Hold on, everyone. I think they're trying to figure out what this guy does. As the dog is cooking in through the ceiling. Kool-Aid man style. I mean, we could go for like a level three here, right? Then we go magpie just to... Just to have another summon. Oh! Oh no! I realized we got rid of Tsuchinoko, and I forgot to move everybody. That is a huge blunder. I don't think we're gonna win anyways, but... Alright. Can't make that mistake again. Let's roll. Let's see what we get. We can sell you. Throw in a sheep. I want to get an Anubis cooking. Could just do it for some trumpets right here. I don't think I mind that too much. Maybe give you a peach. Make you a little more sturdy. Lovely. And we're doing it. <laughs> he keeps doing that. I need to stop holding my mouse there. It's very jarring when you're sitting there expecting it to keep going and all of a sudden it just freezes on you. 
Okay. I feel like we need a hard pivot here. Go platypus deer. And roll me another platypus. Sure. To get rid of Anubis, go secretary maybe? Doesn't seem too bad. Might be enough to get us by. I think it will be. Fantastic news. Keep that health total up. The name of the game. Ooh. Okay. Now we're in it for the hard pivot. As soon as you get a turkey, <laughs> you just instant hard pivot. That's the only way to, to run it. I'll give you an Easter egg. Alright, if we can get a mimic here, dude, we'd be so cooking. I mean, straight up, I don't think there's any way we don't win this. <laughs> you know? If we can get an early lioness, we'd be so in it. They're lioness adjacent. Unfortunately, that's not enough. Um, do we ever just throw in a leopard here? Just for fun. Help counter the turkey plague we've got going here. We can actually level three platypus. That's kind of cool. Uh, I don't, I mean, do we care about a cow? I don't think so. I'm telling you, Linus is where it's at. The Linus pivot is goaded. Oh, I don't like this at all. <laughs> Man, we hit the turkey. We just don't have a strong enough leopard yet. We bl blundered, floundered it, whatever you want to call it. Um, all right, let's do this. Still no lioness, that's crazy. You going snipes? Full send the snipe squad. <laughs> Another giant pivot. It also neutralizes the summons quite significantly. Didn't even think about that. Okay, so let's go here, actually. Yeah, yeah, I think this is better. Ooh, Stegosaurus maybe? Is it better than a Wolverine? Or maybe even better than a Turkey? Hold on to him. I can't decide. I mean, the Mimic is a little... <laughs> He passed his prime three turns ago. Take out the turkey. What the hell? <laughs> Whatever happened to taking out the turkey? Alright, right, we got there. That would have been very upsetting if we hadn't gotten that. Like, come on. <laughs> you gonna do me like that? Okay. We need to get a, a lionfish now. I think that's going to be the play. How do we keep missing the, the turkeys? What is going on here? Roll me. There's our lionfish. <laughs> the turkey will give you three attack, which is very important, actually. Okay, so we run it like this. And then, I don't think we need another turkey. 
That turkey's probably on his last legs, yeah. Let's get you. And now we need to funnel everything into the lionfish. That's gonna be our new strat. Let's give you some fruit. Need a bunch of held foods. Give you a fortune cookie. You know how it is. Get a couple bananas. <laughs> Call it a day. Okay. We got one good snipe. Can we get some more? It feels kind of satisfying running snipes this weekly. Okay. Go here. Roll me once. Way too late for the lioness. Like, not even close to on time. <laughs> okay, good hits, good hits. I think this just nukes everybody, right? As soon as this lionfish goes. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> the goat. We didn't even need a lioness this time. We just go stegosaurus into whatever this is. That felt really satisfying, actually. Alright, we got some games to win. Let's see what we can do. Please, no tennis ball. Witty. Be some concerned forks. Genuinely concerned. Dude, come on. Always coming out here with the tennis ball. Alright, I like the double otter here. Great. Love it. Ooh, another otter. Found three otters on turn two. That is a lot. A lot of health to overcome here. But we do it? Okay. That's the otter power right there. Alright, so now we combine and then level you. Ooh, I like me a foo dog. Maybe we get rid of the... The Bunyip for an Ogopogo. Honestly, straight up. I'm gonna do something insane. Do it like this. Now, I don't know if this is actually good, but it feels decent. Tell me that didn't go well. I guess he did have mice, so. <laughs> Corey deserves his three hearts on turn three. With that kind of build. Um, start me here. Are we looking to level up a golden beetle? Maybe. Maybe, maybe. And then... I'm trying to think the best way. Would we rather have a food dog or an otter? If we were to pick. I think food dog. Even with a level ot level 2 otter. <laughs> um, let's do... I mean, what if we get you to 10? That'd be kind of huge. Uh, we ever run a spider? No. No. That would be ridiculous. Ooh. Fortunately, his mold didn't have anything that could have been a little dangerous. Dude, the con concerned forks are going on a rampage here. I don't know what's going on. Level you. I guess not level. There's the level. Oh man, is it a? Are, are we actually gonna get Anubis to work this time, or is that a pipe dream? <laughs> I want to make it happen. I really do. Oh man. I mean, I'm down to try it. Oh shoot. <laughs> I do that way too often. I have one gold and I sell one. One guy. Ooh, that guy's huge. What the heck? Alright, now we put you in here. Uh, let's roll. Ooh, level me. Alright, I think Ogopogo should head on out. I think he's served his time. If we do a little something like this. This seems kind of nice. I think we can work with this. Mm 
<laughs> His door head ant just screwed him over. Love it. Um, are we giving garlic? I probably should. Okay. Platypus is better than the sheep. Um, I think we can roll here. Maybe hold on to you. Oh. This might be the time for the Anubis to actually pay off. Really, the Anubis value is quite limited, admittedly. It's like we're looking for a lionfish Anubis combo. So like, is it going to be ultra high-end potential? Probably not. That doesn't mean it ain't good, you know? Oh yes, we have to sell you. I think... It doesn't feel worth it to invest in the Golden Beetle. <laughs> Over our other guys, just because we're planning to get rid of him. Oh dude, it's happening. Like, maybe we just want the deer here instead of the Golden Beetle. You know? Ooh, I love it. Oh, hold up. I think we found a new combo. Ew, ugh, gross. <laughs> that was terrible. Yeah, because then you get triggered and then you get triggered again. Okay, hold on. We might be on to something. Um, do we level? Roll me once. Ooh. I think I'd rather get a turkey here. And then we'll look for an Anubis level. There it is. Oh, dude, we're cooking. We are cooking up something nasty today. I'm loving this already. Ooh, we found a deer. Alright, start me with a level. Not who I was hoping for. I think we we get rid of the food dog here. We can go deer and combine, because it'll get the turkey buffs. And then I think we run Spino here. For the first time, we're actually online with the Anubis. Now we just need to find our little homie. Our little lionfish homie. This seems kind of cooking. Anyone else feeling it? I'm feeling it. Okay. So, let's see. I think we're rolling here. We like full sending the Spinosaurus angle. I kind of want to run... Run the Lionfish here. Stegosaurus is definitely a play. Okay, tell you what. We're ditching... Who are we? Yeah, okay. We're doing it. We gotta commit. So let's buy sell a cow. That's just always fun. Now you need to be higher attack than the Anubis. I'm not looking for for more turkeys here. We're looking for the lionfish. Looking good, looking good. Oh baby, we're doing it. We can get this lionfish. Oh, we're gonna be so online. Probably. Come on, what do we got? Um, we could cockatoo maybe. I 
like a lioness here. Another stegosaurus, huh? Could run that instead of the deer, maybe. We are just going to want to stack stegosaurus. That is definitely a part of the play, at least. Oh, that guy's huge. That guy's enormous. Dude, if we don't find a single lionfish, I'm going to be genuinely upset. Come on. <laughs> okay. It's gotta happen eventually, right? You would think so, at least. Yeah, we're doing it. We're good. We're getting there. Lionfish. Lionfish me. Um, level. Oh man, this is getting a wee bit frustrating. Throwing a lioness. How many runs do we need? before we find our lionfish. How long is it gonna take? He found a level three lionfish. Where is that one for me? Ridiculous. Nothing. Not a damn thing. Um, hold on to you. I don't- I can't tell you how many times we've rolled and haven't found a single one. That's crazy. We're still okay. Alright, come on. Just- just one. Just a single lionfish. That's all I'm asking. Just one. <laughs> come on. I'm begging you. I'm begging you. Finally. Okay. Dude, this is... I'm genuinely frustrated. <laughs> that this is what it's taking. We can't even level him anymore. We've spent like 400 gold finding it. That is despicable. Lionfish can go straight to huge seeds. Oh, I didn't mean to. Okay, get your mind out of the gutter. Grow up. <laughs> Alright, we get a dub. Love it. Nice try, guest. Guest. Alright, groundhog. Uh, we can throw in a ferret, I guess. Refresh our tennis ball. Ooh, another ferret. That seems alright. A little level two tennis ball. That was aggressive. I mean, maybe we're gonna run a balloon here, you know? What if we just balloon this thing? Into an eel? Okay. Okay. <laughs> this might just be the greatest play ever. I'll throw in a hedgehog. Has a little backup in case we have issues. That's alright. I think we're okay with that. Get rid of the basilisk. I'm down to run otter. Hopefully it hits... Oh, hit everything except for the eel. 
That's cool. Maybe we want some health potion? Though I guess garlic is probably better, isn't it? Come on, hit the eel. Dude. Guy hates me. I don't even know why. I'm a food dog. What did I do to deserve this? Okay. Alright, I see you. Ooh, another food dog. Into a garlic. Into a... Roll. Into another food dog. Ah, secretary bird, I see. We have the worst team imaginable for secretary bird. <laughs> but there's enough we can pivot if we want to. Which I imagine we probably would. A lot of bunyips you got there, brother. Alright, hedgehog. You're out. Secretary bird is in. Ooh, another food dog. Maybe throw in Easter eggs. Maybe throw in sheep. Bah ha ha Roll me. Garlic coming in clutch. Thank you, thank you. I'm curious, is it tier 4 that the bananas show up? It is. Okay. Anubis? I am interested. If I get rid of the otter here. Do we care enough about the sheep to play a cockatoo? Surely not. Surely not. Um, let's run an easter egg on... You? I'm very disappointed we haven't found any more eels. It's making me a little bit sad. He's still holding his own, don't get me wrong. But... He could be doing so much more. Alright, we need garlic on the Anubis. And then... I don't know. I'm not sure what's, what comes after that. Hopefully we find something that'll tell me. <laughs> Full send. Yo, if we get another pill, we can trigger the secretary bird. Two friends faint. <laughs> I mean, it's permanent scaling, I key. We do this. There it is. We sell you, throw in a tar. So who do we want to get permanent buffs? I'd reckon probably Anubis. If I had to like, hard count on one pet sticking around, I think it's probably going to be this guy. If we can get him to level 3. Still needs garlic. I keep forgetting. He's missing on the garlic. This team's kind of cooking. Low key. That's not half bad. Ooh, level me. An orca. Talk to you. We own spinos. I don't know, I feel like we just run orcas here, right? I don't know if we have enough feints to warrant another angle. Like a Spinosaurus angle. Roll me. Ooh, food dog. Um, we could try a banana. Faint pet from any pack. How crazy is that? The monkey may be going soon. I'm not sure yet. That's a classic no turkey angle right there. Let's 
let's not worry about the monkeys. Let's figure out our team first. Found it. Alright. This is our redemption opportunity. This is where we get the lionfish and we go in. Fantastic. Dude. <laughs> And the Wolverine, it's happening. Alright. I'm sorry, but you're gonna be gone. Wolverine, good stuff. Um, let's just do it like this, I think. You don't have to be up front, do you? No, you kinda... It helps have the Wolverine here. Oh, and you have to be up front for the monkey. That, that's, that's a valid argument. Not quite enough to cover that. Hmm. A little better, better snipes and we're cooking. Ooh, yes please. Uh, we don't need Linus anymore. Because we've got monkeys. And monkeys are great. I wonder if we should have gone monkey level up instead of the this guy. Feels really good though. But it does feel kind of bad not having any... Oh, that's fine. Not having a whole lot of attack on him. Let's see if we can remedy that. Oh, baby. We get the best of both worlds. This is looking great. Already up to 20 attack. Dude, hit the turkey for crying out loud. You have something against hitting turkeys? <laughs> like what? <laughs> what was that all about? Um, let's roll. Level you. I don't think we need you. I think we're already kind of set. Hold on to you. Any immediate attack is more important right now. What if we don't find any? I'm fine getting a lionfish to level 3 if possible. Oh yeah. <laughs> now this is what I was looking forward to. Do we have enough to take out this dog? Uh, just kidding. <laughs> that dog was kind of thick with it. Alright. We get another opportunity. Throwing a chicken leg. Straight up. No. We could Stegosaurus and try to get lucky, but it's, it's too much sauce. Let's just roll it. That's more like it. <laughs> That's more like it. I'm glad we finally got that to work. I had been picturing it in my head this whole time, and I was just waiting for the opportunity. And after the last game, where we got absolutely bamboozled, <laughs> I feel like it's only fitting that we got it working. Hope y'all enjoyed. If you do, drop a comment, like, sub. Love hearing from y'all. But for now, I'll see you on the next one.